Hello everybody. Monday again. Monster Hunter Mondays. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. Happens. At, at first of what? all, what's Monster Hunter? Second of all, what's Monday? So, first of all, what's your name? Uh, pff, boy, I'm really drawing a blank. Uh, Brelston here. <laughs> and I'm uh, Yuri, uh, otherwise known as Tupindo on the internet. So, uh, and what is a Monday, really? Mm -hmm. First day Miserable of pile of secrets? That's a man. It's a man. Okay. I'll just be quiet. Yes. <laughs> so what are we doing today? <laughs> this is our weekly stream. If you're watching us for the first time, uh, we do this every week. Uh, Monster Hunter is uh, my favorite game. And uh, I'm going online here, going to the menus. Mm -hmm. We play with you guys. Right now we have Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate, which is out now for our 3DS and Wii U. If you have the Wii U version, you can play with us. And uh, next year we'll have uh, Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. 4 Ultimate on its, right on its way. Yeah. So... Um, so finally, 3DS players will be able to go online and hunt with us. So um, A lot of cool new monsters. Oh, yeah. And, and my old ones, too. And my favorite, the bug staff. <laughs> you'll, you'll, you'll hear more about it later. Yes. Okay. So let's cut to the game here. I'm creating a room, actually, so not the game yet. Uh, where's... Okay. Sorry. It's my first time doing this. Uh, yeah, we usually are in Help D Lobby 10, as you can see there, um, where we hop in and help you guys... Play if you so if you, have, if you have a Wii U copy of Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate, yeah, uh, you should hop in every Monday. That's right. So, anyways, uh, I have here, and we do this from three to four. We got Kitty online already. Um, I you're gonna you're gonna be uh, oh bought the wrong thing. You're gonna be slightly weirded out by what I'm gonna be doing today, Brelson. Oh really? I I heard about this on the internet. Uh, I saw it on the on a forum thread that was kind of mentioned as a quote to in, in another thread and it was this magic set here that uh, this armor set here that user Godhand put together uh, you might remember his name on, on our weapon videos yeah, so we did yeah. the longsword and the our axe. YouTube series of I mean, the uh yeah longsword and hunting horn we did and um, and yeah he's uh, he's got some great tips and then he came up with this set for for uh, sword and shield, uh -huh. it's got trap master, bomber, deer, sharpness plus one, evasion plus one. Sounds uh, good. So guarantees. Oh man, trap combination. All right. Well, this I just read something I didn't know. Uh, <laughs> but anyways, so this one here um, increases, speeds up trap and bomb uh, setting time. Okay. So every time I set a bomb, it's really fast. Yeah. So. And then the bomber deer makes them stronger. Yes. So, and then I eat for pyro, and that makes it even stronger. Okay. And and a sword and shield, you can use items without putting your weapon away. Right. So I'm there hacking away, put a bomb, slash, jump away. Evasion plus one will oh, sort of can, guarantee get away, that I yeah. get away without getting hit. And it's pretty crazy. Man, yeah, so if, I mean, if all those things come together, that's quite a quite a setup. Yeah, I tried out, like, a couple of times. So this is day. a mix of, what was it, Narga and... So it's got a... Uh, He's got two versions of this, and this is the one that I could have made. Uh, okay, I see. So Narga you, helmet. You, you got the Narga helmet Z, which is the green Narga Kuga. Damascus, which is mixed, but but based on Gen Moran, Hollow Gen, and uh, Vangus, which is uh, Devil Joe. Hmm. The Vangus bus is coming. Yes. <laughs> Aren't the Venga boys Brazilian? Is that uh, the really? I didn't. Man, that sounds. I think they oddly. Are. Like, it makes sense. <laughs> I think they are. Well, they have a song, track five on their album, the party album, is Brazil. Oh. The name of the song is Brazil. My knowledge of crappy 1999 to 2001 pop dance music is extensive and embarrassing. <laughs> Wait. Shall we talk oh, about Alice DJ now? Because I could keep going. Uh, no. Man, I didn't know it guaranteed uh, combination success. That means I can combine... Tons of bombs without having to worry about combo books. The more you know. So let's jump on a quest, maybe, right? Uh, just typing here. Oh, I have Rock, Sari, Kitty. Oh yeah, Ro Rock and Sari joined right after. So if any anybody, feel free to post a quest. I'm of course gonna be rocking this set for the first. Actually, no. I heard Rock wanted to post the Super Bracky. I don't want to do that right now. <laughs> well, Con Man wants me to talk about Alice DJ, so <laughs> get ready. Do you know the song? Uh, everything begins with an E. 
on the album, Al uh, the Alice DJ album, uh, is the exact same song, more or less, as uh, the Venga Boys have a second album called the Platinum Album, and they have the same producer, or some something like same producer, same mixer, or something, and basically the same song is on two different albums, wow. uh, spaced about uh, over a year, and. It's like the exact same main melody in both songs. It's not even one of those things that oh, that sounds you know that sounds a lot like it's the same song, <laughs> released on two wow, different albums really? from two different. Uh, How do they get away with it? Uh, same same producer or whatever. Huh. Uh, I li yeah, because I listen to the yeah. It doesn't matter. Al's DJ also. I remember uh, they stopped uh, performing in two thousand one. Oh. Uh, I didn't follow them after that. So, better off alone. Great great Al's DJ song. Um, that's the one that made me uh, go look into the album, and the album's pretty good. If you like, if you have a high tolerance for <laughs> crap, for crappy pop dance music, then uh, oh boy, you're really gonna like that album. Uh, no, it's really great though. All right, I need gunpowder. All right, so I got some stacking up here. 460 slime, bombardier, pyro. Let's do this. Um, I was timing it pretty consistently on the 3DS, but uh, with the Wii U being online, you know, there's the occasional, uh, you know, frames that I so might miss here. So what are you hunting? Uh, we're hunting, the quest is, I was going to say hunt all monsters, isn't it? Uh, here, March of Victory. Oh, in wow. that order. It's pretty good. It's a pretty good assortment. Yeah, I think they're in the, I think it's in the arena. Yeah, land arena. Uh, again. And... They're they're not all at the same time, right? There's only <laughs> there's only uh, yeah. What? So, uh, at maximum two at the same time, but I don't think any of those are at the same time. It would be cool if uh, Ivory Laggy and Stygian Zenobia were at the same time. Just saying, I would I would enjoy that. All right, I don't need any of this. If you wanna raise, welcome to Quarry. Oh no, these two are at the same time. All right, there you go. So it's a Rust Durambros and a Bracky. Yeah. All right, let's do this, right? One, two, take a step. Oh, nope, wrong step. S See, I'm not. I'm still not that good at this. Well, that's what I love so about. Anyways, one, boom, and then dodge. I didn't get bomb damage. Oh yeah, Rust Durambros, you gotta. Uh, Whoa, man, crap. this is that is a big Durambros. Holy yeah, crap. I know he's pretty big and annoying. I think I picked the right quest. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like the Bracky uh, headbutted him in the corner. That was pretty cool. All right, everybody. Flash bomb in. But I did love how uh, that was a great example of, like, all the planning that went into that. Like, oh, man, I've got all these skills activated. I'm going to drop this bomb. And uh, it's, this is on paper, this is so unstoppable. Ah, oh, I missed And that. then, yeah, it all comes down to, like, it's <laughs> just like Street Fighter. It's just down to execution. It's You've got the plan in your head. Yeah, 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 you know that crouching medium fireball is gonna work, but can you pull it off like drop of a hat, like yeah. uh, the moment you're in range with with no errors? Oh, <laughs> somebody else detonating the bomb. <laughs> uh, oh, Bracky is Bracky's stacking a trap. Yeah, but you know he'll, he'll be he'll be fine. He'll be fine. <laughs> he'll be fine. Oh. So you're also using a slime weapon, so the bombardier will yeah, uh, it works for both. Uh, help here. Yeah, I'm trying to tackle the tail here. Oh, and then I got hit. When are we getting Strider Cross Monster Hunter? Man, I wish there I wish there was a Strider costume. That's for sure. Yeah, I'm trying to get in that. Failed again. Oh, Gary, come on. It's my first time playing, okay? <laughs> wow, that was pretty cool. Oh! Alright, and then here's the trick, right? So you go here, combo list. I set up, uh, if you set up combinable, and the only thing you have in your <laughs> thing that you can combine with bombs, it's gonna be the first thing in the list. So you already got three more bombs. And here's the, the key to this, too. Like, you gotta bring ten barrels and ten gunpowders, at least. So you can make a total of thirteen bombs. Whoop! And then get Packing a over. punch. And he's not even the one that's good at punching. Whoa! 
Alright, let's get this done. So it looks like uh, Seraphie and Red Stash have started their own room uh, to, oh. to play as well. So that's uh, in the Monster Hunter spirit. There you go. Well, he is oh. not even trying to get out of this hole. No, he's, uh, he's knocked out. Oh, he's hammer. knocked out. I see. Okay. That's one of the beautiful things you can do with a hammer. Ooh, thank you. All right. Bracky, chill out. Oh, he Man, ignored that. That was pretty nice. He just came running under the tail. It's cool. Oh, man. Oh! <laughs> oh, the Bracky Punch, I think, that needed that. <laughs> really seems like one of these... Uh, I guess the Durambros is just such a sponge, though. Because it seems like with four monsters... Ah! Wow. Wow, yeah. Maybe they didn't even scale health on this one. Oh, I'm oh nice. Uh, all for oh. nothing. <laughs> oh, some, somebody took a life powder. So I got, I got more health. Narwalicus wants an Ao. All right, Drambro's down. Bracky, you're my favorite. Come here. No, 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 no. Oh, lock that. Uh huh. That attack is blocked. But you need a shield. Somebody like Ryu. Back in the trap he goes. Nope. No, oh, no, no. Know your weapon etiquette here. Let the hammer go to the head and. Sword and shield, you don't have any place here. Oh, I got the bomb, man, and I got the thing right. That's true, that's Too true. Too bad I was clipping through the <laughs> Durambros. Yeah, the Durambros needs to get his ghost out of here and. Uh, Three more bombs, there you go. Boom. Oh, gosh. See, I, when I was practicing this, because I just made this set, right, uh, today, uh, I saw that thread today, and then I spent some time after uh, making this. Oh, oh God! Yuri. That reached me. I didn't Shameful. No more fainting. Remember what I said, right? These, these are now going on YouTube. So oh, we're going, man. We're uh, for shame. And I get called out in the chat. I know, Or right? in, the, uh, in, the, in the comments. And Getting called uh, out in the chat is way is, is one thing. Getting called out in the comments. Not on YouTube. It, it mean, like lasts forever. <laughs> it's the, yeah, like the uh, <laughs> looking up some uh, old game music for like Bubsy, and there's like <laughs> there's like a comment from this is like six years ago. It's like oh my god, the <laughs> idea of a YouTube comment being seven years, six or seven years old is like wow. Ugh. A YouTube comment. YouTube comment. Yeah. Oh, I think it was. I was looking at Mystical Ninja music, and. Uh, Legend of the Mystical Ninja Super NES uh, music, and there was just some comment like seven years ago. <laughs> wow. Seven years ago. What was that? Look this way. Oh, 2007? Man, I'm, am I horrible at flash bombs? Oh. So, yeah, I was testing, the, as I was saying, I was testing the setup, but I was doing mostly against like high rank monsters. Just so I could get some right experience, know, get some leeway, get some hits in, and not have to worry about dying immediately. And uh, and yes, uh, it was kind of I haven't fully practiced everything. Kitty saying first time using this weapon. Oh, that's the Animal Ripper. That is the the great sword that you get the super super Stygians and Ogre quest. And uh, it's got like 500 fire or wow. 600, 600 fire. It's a ridiculous amount of fire element. But it needs Awaken, which the Escadora set has. What is that set? Escadora is the uh, Alatrion. Oh, wow. All yeah, the hunting ho uh, wh Basically, whatever had a hunting horn is what steered my, uh, steered my interest. So... Mm -hmm. uh, since Alatrion did not have a hunting horn oh, so weapon to pull from it, I was like, meh. Don't Look care. how fast I put these down. Don't care. <laughs> don't care. Alright, uh, whoever is spawning here. Wait, so are the two at the end? Yes! Oh, man. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, my, 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 gosh. my butt. I wanted this. Oh, um, yeah. I 
Ah, oh, almost dodged through that roar. Oh, here comes the Zenogre. Get out of here. Oh, Ooh. man. Oh, dear. <laughs> you dumb lizard. <laughs> Learned that one from you. I didn't used to say that before. All right. But it is... Laggy is kind of like a crocodile, right? Laggy's like a... Uh, I don't know. Cobra crocodile? Man, he's... He's all messed up already. Oh. Oh, man. Zenogar, really? Uh, no no berries. Fantastic. All right. That was a pro flash bomb. Got both of them. Man, the Aquari Aquari is saying slime needs to be buffed in 4U. Why? Hang on, what? <laughs> so I'm guessing is a jest. Because that was always like one of the recurring gags of uh, us oh. us all sitting around the table going, oh, what's it weak against? What's it weak against? And somebody just be like, slime it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when in doubt. Or well, I guess did four nerf it, and then it needs to get maybe. you know buffed again. Maybe that's maybe that's what's going on. That four G needs to uh, maybe find a balance between three U and four. Yeah, maybe. But who knows what what they're doing, right? Uh, hopefully, we would. <laughs> we're, uh, we're Capcom. Shh, that's my way of getting out of it. Yeah, <laughs> I guess that's true. <laughs> Please look forward to more information later in the year. <laughs> Unless you're watching this on YouTube months, months later than, uh, you know. Then you're too late. Go watch a 4 Ultimate clip. It's out now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you're watching this a year from now. There's no way you can ever be watching this a year from now. No, but, no, I mean, if there's seven-year-old comments about Bubsy music, then someone will find this a year from now. I guess so, huh? An amazing time capsule. Let's both remember to watch this next March. March 3rd, people. Whoop. Oh man, how did that roar get me? Oh my god. Ooh. Nice. Was it the laggy? I guess laggy the laggy down. went down. Uh. Man, this was amazing. I didn't expect them to be at the same time. I love this quest. Man, did it just get. Man, the chat isn't scrolling. It's getting stuck. Really? Yeah, like it'll. it'll Bring up like two new messages and then just say more messages below and stop scrolling. Oh man! So now, set up <laughs> so now I can't keep up with the conversation. Looks like you got a job there with the scrolly thing. I know. All right, so we both set up a trap right next to each other because thought that would be cool or something. Um. Uh, no plans on. MH Online for North America, as is our usual answer. Yeah. Hmm. Whoa, why is this? Why is he so? I love this. Being able to do use pretty much any item without having to put the weapon away. So useful. Saves so much time. Oh yeah, that's the other thing that. Uh, so this the original set by uh, Godhand had um, speed uh, speed sharpening, but I do not have the right talisman for evasion plus six with two slots. So so yeah. Oh man. Oh. It's my new favorite quest, man. I got no more bombs though. Seems like he's got to be going down soon cuz with yeah. all with all four of you teaming up Got the mix up over there. 
Oh man, it got me. <laughs> uh. Whack. Tail Ooh, off. Tail off. Nice mega potion for everybody. <laughs> damage right now. Ooh, just in time. Yeah. He's going down now, I think. Oh, yeah. yes. Yeah, we saw the great sword charging up. <laughs> it was like, this is uh, this is where it goes. So now we've moved on to uh, Monster Hunter for Apple II and uh, Commodore. I'm moving for Monster Hunter for Vectrix. And Vectrix. Uh, maybe port that to Virtual Boy. <laughs> I want boy. a Virtual Boy port of a Vectrix Monster Hunter game. So is that an up port or a down port, would you uh, say? It's more of a, of a whirlpool. <laughs> mm. ah, Monster Hunter for President. I like that port. Man. Kind of like a great great quest. Ooh, replenish your life powders over here. Uh, -huh. uh the Raddest Bro, I tuned in this week hoping to see some gunner play. Oh man, really? Alright, let's do it then. <laughs> Can't turn down a request from the chat that we can actually uh <laughs> that I we know, can actually right? do. Items, items, items. Who cares? All right. Longest, shortest. 114. Yes. Um, after that, we're gonna get uh, we're gonna get Monster Hunter on uh, the TI-83 calculator. <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be great. I used to have one, TI-83, for my one math class that needed it. Yeah, I had to buy one for like a statistics class in college, and that that's you know I'm normally I was very you know, I wanted to get good grades, and I did. You know, I'd study and really put in the time, just because I don't like, I don't like that feeling of. Even though a lot of the classes are BS, it's still like I don't, li <laughs> I don't like the feeling of uh, being challenged with something and then just totally not doing it. Yeah, yeah. But that statistics class was like the one where I'm like, I'm, am, I'm am gunning for the C. I don't care. Really? Like, it, it, I don't like. Yeah. I'm terrible at math in the first place, but then like equations and stuff, it gets even worse. And then like even with a calculator to kind of do almost all the work for you and a graphing mm -hmm. calculator, I was still like I literally like here's the final, and I just asked the professor like, okay, how many questions do I have to get right on this to get a C in the class? Really? And he's like, uh, out of the you know 30 questions, if you can you get, you couldn't even calculate that. No, I was <laughs> like, well, because I don't know how, what the weighting is, right? Like, okay, I, okay, like so, it. like this this assignment versus all the other stuff. Yeah. And I'm just like, he's like, basically, if you get 12 of these right, you'll get out of the D range and get up to the C range. And I'm like, all right, I'm I'm gunning for the C. Let's do this. <laughs> like, here's the pretest. I'm gonna memorize exactly how to do 12 problems, and then the rest of them, I'm not even gonna look up. I don't care. Ah, man. All right. Yeah, I got a cosmic ticket. Thank you for... Thank you, game, for giving me a cosmic ticket. Uh, man, me and Texas Instruments guys like this. <laughs> All right, so who who asked for gunner play? Everybody in the team that was gunner. Oh, <laughs> wow. All right. This is a recurring thing, uh People ask for something and then they get it. Just stop it. So there hasn't <laughs> been there hasn't really been Monster Hunter PvP, but you were saying MH1 has the mm. two? two dose. Yeah, Japan only, but it had that. Um, so what was it? Anyways, is it, uh, Monster Hunter PvP. Well, is that what's the question really? No, they were just saying that'd be cool. But I was thinking, what was dose oh, like? Yeah, yeah. Was you you was a monster against you or so? You would capture... I don't know exactly the conditions and all the details, but the the story goes like this. You would capture a monster, and then the monster that you capture, like, uh, uh, under certain conditions, again, I don't know, you can capture a monster, and then you can keep it instead huh. of killing it for its parts. Huh. Um, and then you would feed him or something, and then it'll, you know, get stronger mm, stuff. Uh, and then you could go on the arena mode, where you bring your monster and then you're 
opponent brings a monster as well, so you're supposed to kill his monster and he's supposed to kill your monster. So it was not PvP as in like player, right, right. like one person trying to kill the other. It's more like who can kill the opponent's monster first. Right. But it's, it's all in the arena at the same time. Huh. And I, I can imagine like, all right, you can throw a flash bomb on, on, I don't know, on your on the monster that you're trying to kill, and then you can go in to disrupt your opponent with like a hammer swing, so he doesn't get the attacks. Oh, I see. So I, I don't know how exactly it works. Again. Uh, Chocobo kid wants to see the image shirt you're using now. Uh, image shirt. Well, uh, come on camera shirt. here. Yeah, let's uh, do that. I don't know which one that is. He's using the the one that we have at the store, which you can you buy. Can buy is it the same color, this blue one? No, no, it's gray. Gray. And the design is bigger. I, I like the the one at the store. I'm happy with this one. Yeah. Well, the yeah. Uh, yours, and I'm, I'm not wearing sure. Wearing a Uniqlo. Uniqlo shirt from back in. We have one here in San Francisco. So. Yeah. Wait, what what monster are we hunting? Ah. Uh. Oh man, ugh, out of habit, bought 20 whetstones. Gunner! That's what happens, like, things get to be like second nature. Alright, we got some sort of quest up there. Hard hitting lineup. Oh, oh boy. Gosh. Alright, at least I got the right bowgun for oh this. Oh man. Ugh, I I'm really. Totally, I'm totally gonna faint. I almost don't even want to watch this. <laughs> because, like, just the idea of slogging through the fight is enough. The idea of not even being able to participate in it. I mean, it's going to be a great stream, guys. Like, <laughs> it's going to be great. Um, what what do I need for this again? Hi, Mr. Moopsie. Normal 2, Pierce 1. I guess it's not bad. Freeze. All right, let's stock on those first. All right, got normal 2, Pierce 1. Are you working with Combo Fiend or Clockwork? Well, Combo Fiend uh, sits next to Yuri, so... Yeah. If anything is broken in Street Fighter, it's probably my suggestion. Yeah, but you can blame it on Yuri. Yuri is the shadow developer of Ultra Street Fighter 4. <laughs> <sighs> Freeze shots. Do I have para with this? This is the Wii U version of 3 Ultimate, uh, but it is identical to the 3DS version in that uh, the saves can transfer back and forth, and you can kind of freely move your character uh, between the two versions. Yeah. Pl play on your TV, play on the go, which we did for hundreds of hours. Yeah, I got 560 over here. Damn. I think I finally toppled at around two Five hours 220 or minutes. 230 or something like that. Two wow. Wow. Sorry, uh, going gunner takes a little more preparation than I'm used to. So, I need to pierce one, normal two. If you didn't see, uh, we announced, mm -hmm. um... The addition select for Ultra Street Fighter 4 as well. Um, oh yeah, that was my idea. Yeah. No, it was uh, just kidding. I actually remember being a... Uh, that was one of those things, but being in, in the discussions for like er early on for Ultra before even we'd named it Ultra. Oh, um, and it was just kind of <coughs> like, you know, the next Street Fighter 4. Right. Um, and talking about features and stuff to put in it, I do remember... Uh, I don't remember at what point the idea of an anniversary mode entered in, but I remember being like, from the moment it showed up, I was like very much a proponent of it because I thought that 2004 Street Fighter 2 collection mm. uh, was pretty cool because it would let you do a similar thing where you could play various versions of the characters or even Mortal Kombat Trilogy going back to PS1, which was kind of bonkers, but you could play as like the MK1 and 2 versions of the characters within the MK3 shell. Right, right. Uh, right. Which was pretty weird. But uh, this for Ultra lets you play as, you know, in, in a separate offline mode that doesn't interfere with the Ultra gameplay, um, right. in the Ultra balance, you can select, like, Vanilla Sagat versus, you know, Super Street Fighter version of Adon or yeah, etc. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's more of a fun uh, side mode. 
You know, and, and it's especially fun when uh, when Street Fighter 2 did it. It was uh, with the the PS2 collection. Was that right? PS2 and uh, Xbox collection. That's yeah. the one. That yeah, had yeah, it? yeah, 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 yeah. It came uh, uh, came with Third Strike and uh, the the animated movie. Oh man, yeah, I remember having it, but not paying attention to it. That was the first time I experienced Third Strike, actually. Uh, but anyways, I remember being something like, yeah, why would anybody pick any of the older versions of Ryu and hmm. Ken, and none of these guys have super moves and all that. And but that was because Street Fighter, to me, I only saw. I didn't know there was a huge tournament scene back then. Mm, right. And, you know, Street Fighter wasn't all over the internet. So I think now it's even more special for people that are not super hardcore. Like, see, me, you know, I'm not super hardcore by Street Fighter, but I can certainly appreciate how you can outplay as super broken Sagat from Vanilla, right. you know? <laughs> well, it'd be the equivalent of, like, I mean, I don't know what the, if this would actually, how much it would matter, but imagine if a Monster Hunter, like, you get to choose, do you want to fight... You know, the Diablos from MH1 or the Diablos from never, MH3 never. or, you know, <laughs> like things like that. Yeah. Like, I don't know how much they change because, again, 3 is the only one I'm, the, like, super familiar with. But, like, I, I'm yeah. assuming they're subtly different in each game. Uh, yeah. I mean, they aren't. It's not up to the point where um, you can... You can... I don't know. You can't even pick one over the other, really, because it's like it's more iterational and it's not competitive. So there's absolutely no reason for you to pick any of the other ones, you know. Well, I mean, like if they had moves or behaviors that weren't really replicated again, or it'd be more again. It's more of a uh, oh, huh, uh, uh, and uh, not a uh, yeah. Aragon doing his G.I. Joe vehicle impersonation. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Ah. oh boy. Yeah, that's the thing with Gunner. Things take a lot deal a lot more damage. Especially if that Diablo is comfortable with me. But he didn't. Oh, poor kitty. Oh. Of course life powder. Ooh, I forgot I had this skill over here. So this is four gunners? Yep. I don't, I don't know if I've ever played as oh a gunner. Oh gosh. Oh. He's no. down. Dude, dude is sleeping. Our is gonna wake it up. Nope. Oh, kitty's in there with the bombs. Blow his chin up. Go do it. I don't have bombs. Uh oh. Oh. Ah! Oh, I got nice. him. Alright, here comes Diablos. Whoa. That's probably too early. Whoa. I, I don't want to take many risks here with Diablos. promise if you're just tuning in, even though it looked like Yuri was just flailing around, uh, there was a reason for that. There are carefully calculated movements. Oh, boy. Yeah, there's, there's a very good reason. Look at this. Look at my health. Oh, oh God. Gosh. Oh, man. Oh, dear. Uh, I can't do another. Oh! Should have done a Tansy chip in hindsight. Oh, gosh. This, this quest is brutal. Where if I picked this was insane. Uh, talking about... Oh boy, oh boy, here comes the Duracon! Uh, any good pizza near the Capcom office? Yeah, there's... Uh, ah! There he goes! There's pizza my heart. Pizza my heart, yeah. It's not, it's not that far. Yeah. Uh, I'm a big fan of Patchy's. It's not around here, but it's up in San Francisco, and they catered here the other day. They brought some samples by. Uh, Patchy's is great, delicious deep dish. Huh. Uh, basically lasagna pizza. Uh, super good. Nice.
Oh boy. Oh, none of them. So we have to trap here just in case. Boom. Diablo seriously stopped that. <laughs> oh, he's so close. There he oh, goes. There you go. Oh man. Oh no. no. <laughs> this is, Somebody uh, did power shot. Great. Oh, that stacks uh, on top of the trap? Or is he still in the I, trap? No, the trap broke down, but he's paralyzed. Nice. Oh man, we're gone. I saw you there. I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. Kill them. So. As you can probably guess, this is not like your typical first-person shooter. <laughs> yeah, it's a... Or even third-person shooter. It's very much Monster Hunter. Yeah, it's Still gotta learn its ways. Oh, there you go. We're gone in the trap. Uh, yeah, I'm shooting at the same spot, spot just rotating the camera. And the Diablos, the Diablos is, Diablos is under me. the ground. Uh, oh, rock oh there it goes. <laughs> <laughs> Whoosh! I'm sweating here. It was it was a tell. bit much. It was. We can we can do another quest, right? Someone mentioned. Uh, yeah, you got time for one more. Uh, but I mean, as a different one. <laughs> uh, yeah, not that one again. Uh, at least not with that party makeup. Four gunners. No, it, it's totally doable. It's just like I don't have not enough practice for this. And I mean, if there were if it's if it was not the arena, where you can like go out and take a break and. <laughs> right. Someone mentioning. Uh, the Freedom Unite Plesioth fight being particularly difficult. Annoying. Annoying. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, so you gotta imagine that back in the PS2 and PSP days, um, the hitboxes were still a bit of a problem. So, mm. um, so that that's where a lot of the challenge comes in on those titles. I mean, if all of that was fixed, they they would be a tad easier, you know. Uh, you should do awesome maw naked. No, no. All right. <laughs> Trying to to find like an equivalent, but one that is not in the. Oh, uh, is this a hip check thing? Like. Yeah, and then the tail swipe. Dubious hit boxes and. Yeah, the tail swipe was kind of awful. Whoa. <gasps> Oh, what was that? And he's almost the part where you can fight a T-Rex and Rathian. Oh, Metal Gear Solid uh, Peace Walker. Peace Walker. <laughs> Kitty's saying my dad is playing Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker for the first time. Yeah, Peace Walker had a little uh, monster cameos where you could fight a T-Rex and a Rathian. I know, that's so crazy. Uh, Are those in the, the HD, the console port? I, think I so. guess. Yeah. Yeah. Should be. Uh, Rice is nice saying when's Throwback Thursday with Monster Hunter on PS2 Could probably uh, do that sometime yeah I mean this year is the 10th year uh, anniversary 10th anniversary, anniversary of Monhun so it makes sense to do stuff like that this year alright we got we got two quitters here one with the switch axe one with <laughs> no quitters come on you're Just, sticking uh, you're sticking with your gun yep sticking with my guns here No, we got Rock with his hammer, and I think Sari picked the. Sari? Yes, Cyril. Sari, I think. Picked the switch axe. Mm -hmm. uh, this stream is every Monday. Yep. Uh, I got the graphic right here. We got Monster Hunter Mondays every Monday at 3 o'clock. Sometimes we, we go the, two hours. The, the PIP has information too. Uh, which one's the PIP? Capcom Fighters PIP. Be this be guy. Hey, yeah, wow, look at that. Go. All right, look at all them graphics, everybody. Pick it up now on your platform of choice between the two that are available. <laughs> um, but yeah. Man, look at all that stuff. Got got the Facebook on there. Got the Twitter. Yep. Kids today. No Tumblr, no Instagram. <laughs> no Pinterest. Sorry about that. I'll... Put that as a negative remark on my 
on my own report. Uh, what's, what else is going on over here? But yeah, this is every Monday. We t typically uh, three o'clock. Um, typically an hour, though. Yeah. Occasionally it goes to two hours. Um, today is not one of those days. But uh, also occasionally on a Tuesday when we have to make up. Yep. Cannot go a week without it. Mm -hmm. When I do, I start shaking by the end of Friday. It's true. Start to it, start to it. deteriorate. We get dizzy on Thursday. Oh man, crazy. Yeah, our LinkedIn profile for <laughs> Monster Hunter. Uh, uh, yeah, this shirt, uh, my shirt at least, uh, the gray version of the Melinx is on uh, the Capcom store, shop.capcom.com. There you go. Um, where you can buy other things that pertaining to Capcom, including an umbrella umbrella. Yes. Um, hey. Various game soundtracks and some toys, action figures. Toys, right? Statues. Um, Have you ever met uh, actual, like, actually somebody that you said toys and they got, you know, they flipped out at you? Uh, I mean, you've been to a lot of conventions and stuff. I like mean, that. I'm definitely one of the people. I I only got irritated when people would call them dolls. Dolls. And like, okay. oh, here's your dolls. And like, you you gotta stop. <laughs> it's not a it's not a doll. It's an action figure. <laughs> Or it's a bust, or it's a statue, or it's a something. It's not a doll. Even yeah. if it has clothes that I put on it, it's still not a doll. <laughs> I mean, I guess actually in that yeah. case, when you get into the, you know... Changing clothing. You know, I had Star Trek, you know, next-gen things of, like, Picard and Data, and they come with uniforms, and it's like, I, this is a doll at this point. Yeah. Um. How about when people walk by your desk and they say, Venom. Yeah, I have the black costumes uh, collection and oh, like a cool Venom collection, <laughs> and I have to then like, okay, <laughs> you bothered to come over here and, and engage with me, <laughs> and now you're gonna learn the difference between Venom and just plain black costume Spider-Man because I'm gonna tell you, <laughs> it's not even that complicated. Yeah. But ah, oh, cool Venom collection. Mm hmm. <laughs> And I think one didn't. I, I feel like somebody came by and was like, "Oh, cool carnage out like collection." I'm like, "Oh God, I don't, <laughs> e like, I don't even know where to start, man." This is wrong in so many ways. Oh, what a jerk! So wait, which which quest is this? I didn't see. It's a Rogan and a Steel Rogan. Oh man. Oh, here they are, both in the same quest. In the same area. Nope. Oh, missed that one. These little poop bombs. I don't mind finding wood or a gun, but two is too much. They're they're both Alright, he's leaving, he's leaving. <laughs> oh, that's fine. That's, that's fine. Oh wow. Destructible environments. I never that was not a thing until Monster Hunter tried. Naturally, made its way to three up. Yep. Uh, wh when will you start trickling for you info? I mean, a lot of it needs to be synced with Japan since it's not out in Japan either. Um, yeah. We're lucky uh, in that we were able to, you know, at least be forward enough to say it is definitely coming uh, without yeah. having you guys wait for months while we just, you know, figure out, you know, confirming it. So. There'll be a little bit of a of a we're we're currently inside of a bit of a quiet period, but uh, it shouldn't be too much longer. I mean, E3 is in June, and that's always you know you can pretty much bet there's news around that. Um, but since it's early 2015, there's still a little bit more work to be done. Yeah. But a uh, couple, I'd say a month or two, a couple months, we'll probably start uh, you know a campaign similar to what you saw with Three Ultimate. Which started in I think August of 2012. It was uh, September. The September. Was September. Yeah. Because it was right after like Gamescom. It's like right after Max. Gamescom, yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so somewhere around there. Beautiful evasion there. Man. Yeah, there is four content that, that that's new to us that's not new to Japan. Um, I think we're just waiting to, rather than have this year-long... Because, again, it's that kind of thing where 
I don't know, when you hear about a game for a full year, um, if it's you not healthy. <laughs> if you yeah, well, if you weren't already bought into it, where you're like, I'm a Monster Hunter fan, I'm totally gonna get Monster Hunter. There's just, you know, kind of a fatigue of hearing about a game off and on for an entire year. Yeah. Whereas at least this will be more like an active campaign that's a little more targeted and focused. Uh, yeah, you have to understand too that the the early announcement was, you know, us trying our best that we can. Uh, I mean, we're always pushing for this, but um, you know, trying to be sensitive to to the people that were asking like for months and months and months and we couldn't confirm anything. Uh, so usually games do not get announced this far in advance. Yeah. <laughs> like if it was a, a thing that let's say like 4 was never a thing and then Japan was also like skipping to 4G or whatever the case may be. If they didn't have anything announced, they would have stayed quiet until 6 months prior to their launch or yeah. something like that, you know. And we were stayed quiet too. But since they already had 4, we figured you know they announce 4G and we don't say anything, they're gonna eat us alive. <laughs> so we pushed really hard and announced it at the same time. Jordan Rodkey saying to calm us the heck down. <laughs> calm us the heck down. It's a uh, it's one way of putting it. But oh, that the fans. <laughs> yeah, but it, it was a it was a case of you know like the community team and Yuri especially you know making it known like. It would be great if we could actually do these things at the same time. And, you know, there's so many people asking every day for 4, and us being able to confirm alongside Japan 4 Ultimate was yeah. was a nice little uh, a nice little boon. And since it's it's not out in Japan either, we're not uh, technically not, you know, it's not really behind. Man, that angle looks really good. Uh, the individual little rocks on his back, that looked oh really yeah. nice. Dynamic sh shading uh, introduced in 3 Ultimate. All these little uh, features. <laughs> okay. Oh, dynamic lighting, sorry. <coughs> and by uh, extension shape. Yeah, games come so far out, I have no clue what we would say there, or if anything. Like, it's it's... Uh, we didn't do nearly as much there oh, last sorry. year as we did in 2012. So I'm not sure what our plans are yet. Oh, man. Those bombs. Give it to me. Kaboom! Whoa. That's the benefit of having, like, gunners in the team, you know? Like, if you don't have a, a bomb detonation set like the one I had for my, my sword and shield, uh, again set creation uh, courtesy of uh, God Hand. I don't know if I would have put that together on my own. Uh, but the thing is, like, you know, you can detonate bombs for people, monsters running away, you can still attack it. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to, like, try your best to get close to it and then attack, and then sometimes it runs faster than what you can um, catch. So, yeah. There are benefits to being a gunner. <coughs> Yeah, we are currently playing the Wii U version of the game. Correct. Uh, Mizaru asking, uh, is there a, quote, easiest weapon to solo G-rank with? Just curious. Which I'm sure will, everyone will have their own opinion, but uh, thinking G-rank and thinking going solo, mm. a weapon that might lend itself. Wait, somebody cut the tail? Wow. Ooh, that's nice. Of course I can't. Uh, I mean, I feel like hammer probably <coughs> would be a pretty good choice. Hammer's not a bad, uh, you know, it's pretty good. I, I mean, I don't use hammer, but it seems like a uh, hammer, maybe longsword. Uh, uh, every weapon is totally viable. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the thing too. Like every, it pretty much is that. Um, I think the if you have to like solo G rank, uh, eventually you start doing with you know. You get good practice with the weapons, the monsters, but I think in the beginning, once you get to G rank, things hit a lot harder. So, yeah, my recommendation is definitely getting uh, an evasion set. So, you know, an armor set that has evasion skills, and uh, and a weapon with a shield, like so, either lance, lance or shield or would be a good choice. You know. Oh right. man, right in, the, right in the groin. Oh, he 
he's, this guy is. A lot of folks saying longsword. Yo, know, switch axe. I've been doing the working on the switch axe video now, and it's pretty powerful, you know. So. There it goes. There you go. See how fast that was? It was a decisive victory. There you go. Also, a lot of people say that gunners are really, really overpowered. Once you understand the whole dynamic of gunning, you know? Yeah, once you, I mean, in a way, it's like, yeah, if someone's going to bother to put in that time, go. F <laughs> you deserve the. Yeah. You deserve it. <clears throat> I mean, you'll see people, like, they get the the pattern of the monster down and from there it's just like avoiding one hit or two occasionally and and then pew 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 just like she's doing right here just like Kitty's doing right now <laughs> <laughs> oh she got the silencer that is kind of neat I do miss uh, the corn co the corn cob gun lance though that was pretty good <laughs> and you're just asking for it I was hoping somebody would whack it. Where, <laughs> isn't there a great sword in here? It could have. Uh, that was the the hammer. Could have oh, launched me that could have worked too. Uh, Genos, Genosi, Genoko. Don't you mean something? Fun Lance? Yeah, don't you mean the Fun Lance? I feel like that would have been like a, a, a. I don't know. Hanging out with you guys, there's always like Sw Simpsons quotes being thrown around. Like, if, if the Simpsons were playing Monster Hunter and somebody said the gun lance, one goofy character would come out and say, Don't you mean the fun lance? Like, don't you? That's no. not how Simpsons works, Yuri. No. Sorry. Okay, sorry. It's just me. Poor attempt at... That, the way you said it, though, did remind me of dental plan. What? Oh, God. <laughs> sorry. Lisa needs braces. Dental plan. Lisa <laughs> needs braces. Dental plan. All right. So Anything is this that does not even that? Nope. God. Sorry. Oh. Oh, I gotta what? leave. All right. Yes. Time to prance, everyone. Yep. <coughs> so on the camera here. Yep. Once again, this is a weekly ordeal. <laughs> uh, you can you can put the PIP so they can. Oh, I forget that we have this thing, man. Nope, nope not that one. Whoa. Ah, there you go. All right, the chest. You can see the prancing and us. Yep. All right. Hey. Yeah, thanks for watching. Thank you. Every welcome. Monday, 3 o'clock. Yes, that is correct. And you already know the channel. All that information is yep. right here. Nope, and over here. Yeah. <laughs> um, and uh, I think tomorrow and Wednesday, Greg will, Greg Amanda want to be streaming more Remember Me. Oh, yeah, he's been uh, We've been though. playing through the game in French. Mm -hmm. And then Thursday is Throwback Thursday. I'm not sure what we're playing this week, but Greg's on that as well. And then Friday is right. Capcom Fighters. Different Twitch channel, but um, is. Uh, yep. Nidel and challenge Peter Capcom. do challenge Capcom, and you can so play uh, Street Fighter yeah. Four content every day of the week. Every day, almost. Wow. Yeah. So yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks, chat, for hanging out with us. Yeah, and, and uh, uh, giving yeah. us all the requests for gunning and <laughs> what was the other one? Uh, I think that was the. <laughs> yeah, was there the was a specific request. request for some gunning. Yeah. So, yep. anyways, thank you all for watching. I'll see you next see Monday. Bye bye.